Drop pass. This is Radina. Radina with a shot. They score! The first goal by Radina. Lucas Radina and the Killer Bees get on the board. So the power play expired, but the Rear Grand Valley get the first goal of the game and of the season. Came at 19.29 of the second period. And it's one nothing. Back into the zone is Radina. Again, another looping shot. Did they score again? The Rio Grande Valley gets the second goal in a matter of the first minute of the second period. At 19.09, it may have been Radina. So it's two to nothing, Rio Grande Valley. And now there's a little fisticuffs going on here. Away from the action. I knew that was going to happen tonight. That's Nick Babcock. And I had to catch the number of the, the killer bees. I was looking where the puck was. They separate them. And <laughs> that is Banks Burkhart. Banks Burkhart and Nick Babcock both went at it and they'll both go into the penalty box and that got the fans all riled up here. So the first fight of the season, the first fight of the game. Fisticuffs and here we go again. Another right. And they are going at it tooth and nail and they go down to the ice and finally break it up. It was away from the action once again as the puck was sent down the ice and when I turned around to look, both of them were going at it. And that really gets the, uh, the fans all riled up. They love to see these guys go at it. Now each team has three guys in a penalty box. Babcock's already in there. Picks it up the puck, but he loses it. Here comes the bees back on a two-on-two. -two. In on goal. Shooting, he scores! Dominic Duma! Third goal of the period and second goal of the game for Dumas. This is banned. Now here we go. Here's there's a fight, and this is Sullivan for the Killer Bees and Mitch Mercier for the Laredo Bucks. And they are separated quickly, but Sullivan is getting these fans on their feet. Patrick Sullivan and Mercier, Mitch Mercier. So the Bees have won the, the fights here tonight. And they are winning on the scoreboard. To the post and hugs it. Making sure it doesn't get in. Another opportunity. And this time he scores! The Rio Grande Valley Killer Bees scored again and it's 4 to nothing at 6.55 of the third period. One more shot, blocked it to the fence, and that, ladies and gentlemen, is the end of the game. The Rio Grande Valley Killer Bees open up their season with a 4 to nothing win. And I must say, I'm very, very impressed with the quality of play and, and the, the stamina and the, uh, the working of these two clubs, but especially the Killer Bees with the ability to put the puck in the net. Star of the game has got to be the man who has two goals on the night, Dominic Dumas. And I got to give the second star to head to the uh, goaltender, Quinn Yeager, who had pitched the shutout. And let's go with Banks Burkhart with a goal and an assist. And the Killer Bees are out on the ice with their sticks in the air, saluting the fans. The fans love it. The fans enjoyed a really good hockey game here tonight. And I must say, I did too. I really appreciate being a part of this group. And we look forward to many more games together.
here at State Farm Arena. As we mentioned, the next home game is Sunday, 11 Four, which is November the 4th, next Sunday, not tomorrow, a week from tomorrow, 